this is the shooting area you got to stay within it if you shoot shots outside of the shooting area and i'll explain what that is those are penalties every time you fire a shot when you are not completely within the shooting area is a penalty mountain man medical has comprehensive but compact trauma kits with name brand quality components they also have discounts available for firearms instructors, teachers, veterans, and others. Please go check them out at get-asp.com slash mountain man and thank them for sponsoring today's video. So if I was like this and I have one foot outside and I'm shooting these targets, one, two, three, four, I got four good alphas, but I also got four penalties. If you're standing on the pipe, so let me explain what in, in and out of the shooting area is. This is inside the shooting area. This is inside of the shooting area. This is inside the shooting area. This is not inside the shooting area. As soon as any part of my body touches any part of the ground outside of these white lines, I'm not inside the shooting area. Is that as you're shooting or? Correct. Now, maybe I lose my balance and I'm like, whoopsie, and I get back in before I fire a shot, no problem. Maybe we have a stage, now this is not an example of one, but sometimes you have stages where you have the shooting area broken up or maybe there's almost like a shortcut well for instance i could actually even though it makes no sense on this stage i could actually shoot here and run out here and step back in over here and shoot here that's technically legal but it makes no sense but because it's not efficient on this stage but i've seen stages where that makes sense so we're going to go ahead and say today's starting position is toes touching rear fault line so that does mean we're going to have to step into the shooting area and toes touching these two nails just like what i was demonstrating there you have eight paper targets that require two shots minimum each the best two hits on those will score you're going to shoot all the targets in whatever order you choose okay however you want to navigate this stage all right you will note that there's some steel out here some that are painted white some that are painted red i only had so much to work with here and i wanted to force you to shoot certain things from certain areas or spots so the red ones are going to be shot from a specific spot only which is through this window okay you don't shoot the white ones. If you do, they don't count. Those two white ones we're gonna shoot from somewhere other than this window. The only steel we're gonna shoot through that window is the red. The way this is gonna operate, let me give you the procedures and the different commands that will be used. When it's your turn to shoot, you'll come here to the start position and I will tell you, make ready. Make ready is the only time, when you hear that, only from that point forward is only when you may touch it, by that meaning draw your gun out of your holster in this class okay so you hear make ready that's your permission now to draw this gun and i'm still hot from earlier so i'm going to go ahead and use this opportunity okay and i'm going to verify it's clear and if clear hammer down by pressing the trigger and then I'm going to holster. But when you hear make ready, that's your permission to draw the pistol and load it. Okay? Once you're satisfied it's loaded and ready to go, back into the holster. When you're back in the holster, I'm going to ask in like you're in the start position. So feet touching the appropriate marks. And our start position as far as our hands is just going to be wrist below belt. So something like this. So when I see you're in the holster and you're standing there like this, like you're ready to go, I'm going to say, are you ready? stand by and then you can get a beep from a shot timer and that's your permission now to move step into the shooting area shoot the targets as you see fit when you have finished shooting all the targets i will ask if you are finished unload and show clear you will then remove magazine remove any ammunition from the gun itself hold the slide back or lock it back and you should visually, and if you want to physically check, that's fine too. I'm going to also, as the RO, the range officer, also check that you're clear. And if clear, hammer down, like I just demonstrated a moment ago. Slide forward, press trigger in a safe direction, and then holster. Are you ready? 
Stand by. Did I get that one? Nope. Oh. There you go. There we go. You're shooting over it. If you are finished, unload and show clear. If clear, hammer down and holster. Awesome. Thanks. Okay. All right.